What's up, y'all? Got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. We about to get into um, voice. Neek wasn't feeling Corey on her live. Let's get it. Kaisen at most subscribed record recently was broken by streamer Iron Mouse. Kaisen has said in the past that if someone ever broke his record, he would do another subathon. Well, people in LA noticed a building promoting Kaisen at Mafia Thon from November 1st to November 30th. So it looks like we may be in getting a, a building subathon. where Los Angeles. A lot sooner than we think. Stay tuned. I would definitely keep y'all up to date. Corey, according to blogger K, the link to her channel is down below, recently hit Danny with the cease and desist papers. Y'all, I on the phone with Danny, whatever, uh, earlier, right? <laughs> Girl, she called me. She was like, B, Corey to put a motherfucker. Send me a cease and desist. I said, friend, for real? I said, friend, let me see. Send it to me, bitch. At least Sharp he ain't call it a cease and desist. <laughs> that would never get old. I don't care what y'all say. If you know, you know. It will never get old. Decease. <laughs> Me and my people can talk about it. Girl, so she's all about. Uh-uh, bitch, it's Corey. Said I can't say. <laughs> Corey, you just stop that lady from talking about you. You said, this don't have my name in your mouth. No more. Corey, we got, we got to cackle about it over here, friend. Please, you know, friend, you know I'm neutral. Then, yeah, girl. <laughs> she, girl, Sherelle, you just said yours too, friend. <laughs> And uh, I guess daddy said the hers too. Let me tell you something. This has been a funny saga. You hear me? Girl, she, they said they just sending them out, girl. They going to court. I say, Danny, girl, y'all really going to court? She said, oh, yeah, I'm suing. And then Sherelle say, she's suing. De uh, court said, I'm sick of this shit with this I'm sick of it. Speaking of Corey, last night people noticed that he kept gifting Neek a lot of money trying to get her attention because at first sis was ignoring him. Corey keeps his stuff. Thank you, Corey. What's that he's sending? I don't know. Is it money, y'all? It was a whole bunch of coins. Kaz was like, money. Is it moolah? I think Nick was just trying to avoid any issues by ignoring Corey because people are already saying that Nick and Carmen are beefing because Nick didn't go to Carmen's birthday dinner. Which and what you keep sending her gifts for? Oh, he's so messy. That's a messy ass nigga right there. Honey J did drop a video explaining why her and Nick wasn't at Carmen's birthday party. Listen. Are you and Carmen still friends? Yes, me and Carmen are still friends. Just because y'all didn't see me at her birthday stuff doesn't mean me and her are not friends. Y'all do that all the time and it's so weird. Like, relax. Everybody don't come to my birthday things, and when everybody not at my birthday festivities, y'all don't ask if y'all don't ask that person if me and them are still friends. But why y'all do that to me? Just, I'm just putting that out there. Anywho, I'm not saying like I'm doing a tit for tat thing, but Carmen, I do. Don't invite me to your birthday situation, and, I, and you ain't come to mine. Oh, you! I will not. I will not see you for your birthday for a couple years. Don't play with me, and I ain't inviting you to nothing else of mine on my birthday. So, yeah, all right, that is me all day. <laughs> I wasn't with her at the club, but I was at the club. Our sections was literally right across from each other. Seen her, all that good stuff like that. Said hi, whatever the case may be. I was there at the club. Her birthday dinner, I did not go to because I was booked in Atlanta for 20 versus 1 on Ryan the Sauce page. Me and Prime was booked for that video, so it just didn't work out. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to go to her birthday dinner. I had work to do, okay? But I, of course, I wish Carmen a happy birthday. I'll put the text right here. But just because y'all don't see stuff on social media doesn't mean it's not happening. How you really feel? Everybody's speaking on your name. Since me and you did the beat popped out. The way I look at it is, is, you know, due to the fact that, you know, before we popped out, I feel like you wasn't on no drama pages. One, because I'm a private person. I don't, I don't care for the internet. You know what I'm saying? I want to do it wrong. But it's like, well, we did that. It. It's like, I did that to let you know I f with you 100%. You know what I'm saying? Like, we always talk about it. Yeah. So it's like basically like I don't you know I don't give a f <laughs> you know what I'm saying because they for one they don't know me yeah. you know what I'm saying for two anything in, so when the people love it somebody gotta hate it like yeah. that, you know what I'm saying, I'm saying that a fact. lot of people want to be in the business you know what I'm saying because they see that we have a fun with it we don't care for we took us personal we don't care for the internet you know what I'm saying but there was a relationship past before but it's like. God gonna bring you in the whole different route with different different type of souls a different way. That's a fact. So however you dealt with that, you can't deal it with this because this ain't gonna let you deal with it like that. Yeah. You are you feel saying you gotta do no, something different. I don't know like, what you just said. That's how I know. Like I'm not doing this for the cloud. I'm not doing this for no, nah, I'm doing this because I fuck with you, honest God truth. We in real life with this shit. Like, we, we haven't followed this shit for real. And we don't gotta explain nothing to nobody. Yeah. We grown as hell, we parents. 
scratch like that. If we if we didn't show no picture, no 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 no, I'm on your picture for a reason. I love to see you pop your shit too hard, and the good I'll beat the bad. I'm gonna say that. Yeah. But CJ so cool is currently in Dubai. That's dope. That's dope. Lexi and according to CJ, he said that Rosie blocked him. Now remember, CJ so cool said that he broke up with Lexi for good because he was tired of Lexi disrespecting the mother of his child, Royalty. Well, Lexi is currently in Dubai with him, and people are assuming that's possibly why she blocked him because he said that he wasn't gonna mess with Lexi. But this is court ordered as well, so I don't know. We'll see how this thing plays out. They might be going to court again. Who knows? Please pray for me, guys. I am on my way home and I am going to be seeing my kids. Actually, I'm gonna keep it a bang with y'all. I hope I can see my kids, cause if I can't, we about to lay the law down in this motherfucker, bro. I don't know why Shorty blocked me, but she freaking blocked me right before I came out of town. And I've been texting, not every day, I've been texting like every other day saying, can I see my kids? Can I call my kids? I wanna call my kids. Cause when you fly somewhere, you don't know if you're gonna make it back. Of course we expect to make it back, but Stop getting into it with these baby mamas and y'all can see y'all kids. I think that is simple math. Anything is possible. So I've been saying, can I please FaceTime my kids like I let you when I had them? All the messages don't say delivered. Today, I wrote her and said, I'm and coming you gotta home bring it to us, tomorrow. Like, I want my stupid. kids. <laughs> no delivery, stupid. right? So you know what I did? I text my lawyer. My lawyer was like, oh, she want to play them games? But anyway, this ain't about that. So pray for me. Pray for me for multiple reasons because I'm flying home tonight. So of course, pray for my safe travels, but then pray for me that I get to get my kids when I get home because Shorty is a wild and out, of course, as usual, right? But I'm used to it. I'm used to it, y'all used to it. We all should be used to her antics right now. It's nothing new. I mean, it keeps getting worse, of course, but I mean, what more do you expect? So please pray for me, I'm flying home today. I wanna make it home safely and I wanna get my kids my kids need me. You know what they say when I take too long to get them? Daddy, it took so long. We was at mommy house too long. And that means they understand a week to week basis. And anything longer than that, they are uncomfortable over there. They don't like it. So, and I'm not even trying to throw shade, but yeah, this you is the are. truth. So hopefully y'all's prayers work. I hate when they say that. I ain't even trying to throw. Yes, you are. Jordan is now doing videos with Infinity B. I think they're talking, but they're not in a relationship. But people are coming at Infinity for Jordan not taking care of his daughter. Someone said, you mess with Jordan. You should be making him be a father to his autistic daughter. That's Ooh. not an easy job. And you as a woman make it no better supporting his behavior. Just to add a little bit more detail to this statement, recently Sierra dropped a video crying, saying that she wished that Jordan would help her more when it comes to their daughter. So a lot of people are now coming after Jordan. And now the girl that he's talking to, to infinity b okay i'm going to respond to this because i have the time right now and y'all really just be blowing me for real um and say you mess with jordan you should be taking you should be making him take care of you should be making him be a father i should make someone be a father who's already a father who's already a great dad to his child him he just have limitations to things right now so that's real. i feel like that's none of y'all business and y'all on social media have no control over how people, what people go through on a day-to-day -day basis. Like, y'all continue to, like, say bad things, but Jordan is a great person, a great father, so I feel like y'all know what y'all know. But continue to know y'all should have never expected for her to be on y'all side. So, second of all, they have nothing oh, to do with... On his baby mama's side. With me, baby. Me and Jordan is not married. Me and Jordan is not in a relationship. They have nothing to do with me. Me and Jordan uh, have fun together. Me and Jordan do content together. Me and Jordan is a vibe together. So, that's that's it, that's all. Like, all the extra, they have nothing to do with me. That's not my responsibility. Yeah. So, yeah. That's not an easy job. You guys want me to be, to be make? Sierra did respond to Infinity B because she was upset that she even responded to that particular comment. Last time, only last time, talking about this. And we'll just see how this goes from here. So, let me go ahead and play the clip from y'all. I mean, for y'all, because I'm going to get straight into it. Let me start it all over so y'all can hear it. Okay, I'm going to respond to this because I have the time right now and y'all really just be blowing me for real. Um, All right, we heard it. Because, I'm sorry, I didn't know that you were there since right there. Limitations to what? what do you know that I don't know? Because, I'm sorry, I didn't know that you were there since Kinsley was born. She three now, where you been at? Because I ain't never seen you. What limitations? I'm confused. What do you know that I don't know? I'm confused on why you feel like you needed to even answer that. Comment or respond to anything. I'm confused on why you even feel like you needed to do that. Do you not know how many people be up and down with your name underneath my sh 
And if I felt like I needed to respond to that, I would have did that a long time ago. I don't care to respond to you about you. Nothing that has to do with you. You should have picked better when you picked on the nigga that you was fucking. That's not my problem. But don't speak or bring up anything Damn. that has to do with me. Damn. Well. Y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below, girl. If I was her, I'd stay out of that drama. Wouldn't have never said nothing. Wouldn't have never got with the nigga anyway because of that reason. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hell yeah.